A French court has indicted Telegram founder Pavel Durov on multiple charges including complicity in operating an online platform used by criminals and facilitating various illegal activities. Durov appeared in a Paris court on Wednesday following his arrest upon arrival from Azerbaijan. The court has charged him with dozen of offences with most serious carrying a 10-year potential prison sentence. The charges against Durov also include facilitating fraud, money laundering, drug distribution and also child pornography. He is also accused of refusing to provide user data for law enforcement investigations. Durov, who holds a citizenship in France, the UAE and St. Kitts and Nevis was released on a 5 million euro bond but must remain in France and report to police twice weekly until the investigation concludes. The investigation, led by OFMIN, a French investigative agency focused on crimes against minors, reportedly began in February, contradicting earlier statements from the prosecutors. The Telegram app, with a nearly billion monthly users, generally refuses to share user data or chat record with law enforcement. The company maintains that it complies with local laws and argues that it's unreasonable to hold a platform and its owner responsible for user misconduct. Durov's arrest has also sparked controversy, with some activists viewing it as a part of a broader campaign against free speech by Western governments. However, French President Emmanuel Macron has denied any political motivation behind the arrest, emphasizing France's commitment to freedom of expression. The case has raised concern about the potential pressure on Durov to surrender user data. Sergei Narishkin the head of Russia's Foreign Intelligence Service has expressed his hope that Durov will resist to such actions. The outcome of this case can have significant implication for the future of encrypted messaging service in Telegram and the broader debate on digital privacy versus public safety. Now as the investigation unfolds, it is likely going to draw international attention and scrutiny from both tech industry observers and privacy advocates. Don't miss out. Log on to oneindia.com for more updates.